Where do saved audio files go on iPhone iOS 14? If you're wondering where all your saved audio files end up on your iPhone, you're not alone. Let's break it down so you can easily find and manage your audio files. First, it's important to understand how the iPhone stores files. The iOS system uses a hierarchical file structure, but it's not something you can directly access like on a computer. Instead, each app has its own space to store files, which helps keep things organized and secure. When it comes to audio files, they are categorized into different types such as music, voice memos, podcasts, audiobooks, and ringtones. Here's where you can find each type. For music files, you'll find them in the Music app. Open the Music app, tap on the Library tab at the bottom, and you'll see categories like playlists, artists, albums, and songs. Tap on any of these to access your music. Voice memos are stored in the Voice Memos app. Launch the Voice Memos app, and you'll see a list of your recorded memos. You can tap on a memo to play it back, or tap on the ellipsis to share or delete it. Podcasts are stored within the Podcasts app. If you don't have this app, you can download it from the App Store. Audiobooks and ringtones also have their own designated areas. Audiobooks can be found in the Books app, while ringtones are typically managed through the Settings app under Sounds. If you've downloaded audio files from the web or received them as email attachments, they usually end up in the Files app. Open the Files app, navigate to the Downloads folder, or search for the specific file name to access it. iCloud also plays a role in storing and syncing your audio files across devices. To set up iCloud for your audio files, go to Settings, tap on your Apple ID, then iCloud, and ensure the iCloud Drive toggle is enabled. You can then select which apps you want to use with iCloud Drive. If you're having trouble finding your audio files, there are a few troubleshooting steps you can take. Check if the file has been deleted by looking in the Recently Deleted folder in the Photos app or the Trash folder in the Files app. Sometimes, a simple restart of your iPhone can resolve minor issues. Keeping your iOS up to date is also a good idea, as updates often include bug fixes, and performance improvements. In case you've lost some files, you can restore your iPhone from an iCloud or iTunes backup if you've backed up your device previously. By understanding where your audio files are stored and how to access them, you'll be able to manage your audio library more efficiently and enjoy your favorite music, podcasts, and other audio content with ease.